I had spoken to you a short while back. If responsibility and accountability needs to be fixed for Congress's dismal performance in the MCT elections, the Delhi Pradesh Congress Committee Chief Ajay Markin has now offered to resign. Hmm. He says, I take responsibility and I will hold no other position in the Congress party. I want to work as a karyakarta. Ma'am, do you think this should be done? Well, if he's given in his resignation, it's for the High Command to accept it or not. If he has given it in. If he's intending to give it, that's another uh, he's story. He's yet to submit. I don't know, yet to submit, then let him. It's his choice, and it will be the choice of the High Command to take a decision on it. But do you think there is a change required as far as Delhi leadership is concerned, since many were not really happy under his leadership and defected to BJP? No, I can tell you only one thing, that uh, you'd require a change in leadership whenever the High Command thinks so. And it's uh, sensible of Mr. Ajay Makan to, you know, offer to resign. Uh, because what has happened under his stewardship is really something that we are all very concerned about. Ma'am, but he specifically names you and names Sandeep Dikshit when he says that uh, it would be unfair to say that uh, he did not ask you to campaign or for that matter did not show aggression as far as Congress's campaign is concerned. Uh, he says that it's not in the habit of showing aggression towards anybody or in the Congress's campaign. How do you see these statements coming? Well, for a start, he never asked me. He never asked Sandeep to campaign. To the, never, never. If he's saying that, he's talking, you know, he's just not saying the correct thing. So if he never didn't ask me to, I didn't campaign. After all, you know, if I have to be asked, I certainly would have done it. He didn't ask me. Now to put the blame on somebody else. And so how do I sabotage when I'm not even going out anywhere? I'm sitting at home. So is Sandeep. He's most of the time, you know, okay. traveling or whatever it is. So what, what is there to, why is he trying to put the blame? And if... Uh, he's trying to put the blame that he lost because it was somebody's... Ma'am, he says that uh, you and Sandeep Dikshit criticized him constantly and he never really turned around and responded. How does he know we criticized him? Have we done it at any time? Show me the, this thing. He has also said that he wrote to me about campaigning. We have never seen that letter. Ma'am, uh, do you think that uh, when a leader is leading an entire campaign, he must take responsibility and resign? Because we saw you doing that when you resigned, because it was all under your leadership, you were the face. So now if he's offering a resignation, it shouldn't be termed as an emotional decision. This is something that propriety should demand? Oh, well, that's for him to understand, to, uh, you know, to, to, if he's genuine about his resignation whether they, that he has to prove to the people, he has, the message has to go to the people. And the high command eventually has to take the decision. He says the Congress's resurgence in Delhi has started. But do you still feel, ma'am, it's a and long if way Congress, to go? If, they, if, they, if he says that the resurgence has started, then why is he resigning? Thank you so much, ma'am. That is Senior Congress Leader, Ms. Sheila Dikshit, who says that uh, it is entirely a decision that the High Command of the Congress Party needs to take if the Delhi leadership needs to change or not. But whether at all Ajay Markan is serious about his resignation is something that will come to light when he actually submits his resignation. Fifth video journalist Sachin Rawat in New Delhi. This is Samir Kapoor. It's just